Welcome back! So far your sock should look something like this. The cuff should be about 8 cm or 3 inches long. And for the main part of the sock we will continue to knit the same ribbing pattern. Knit 2, purl 2, but we will shift the pattern one stitch to the left, which means that we will now have purl 1, knit 2, purl 1. To make this easier, I will knit the first stitch with my last needle. That way I will have shifted the pattern, but I will still end up with knit 2, purl 2 on every single needle. This will make it much easier for me to keep track of where I am in my pattern. Now, knit the first stitch on your second needle with your first needle. Again, knit your first stitch on your third needle with the second needle. Now knit the first stitch on your fourth needle with your third needle.
If you haven't made any mistakes, the last two stitches on your needle should be purl stitches. So this was our first round. We will continue to shift our pattern every four rounds. So the next three rounds will be just normal knit two, purl two ribbing without any shifting. And then we will again shift the pattern one stitch to the left as I just showed you in this video. I have now completed one round of ribbing pattern shifted one stitch to the left, followed by one round of normal ribbing pattern. After this video I will knit two more rounds of normal ribbing pattern. I will repeat these four rounds until my sock is about 28 cm or 11 inches long. Please take a look at the description box to find out how long your sock has to be depending on its size. In the next video we will already start with the toes. So I hope this was helpful and thank you for watching.